Welcome to another Buildbox 3 tutorial. In this video, we will learn how to make confetti effect quick and easy. Here I am using Beta Build 3194. Because I am lazy, I tried to make this confetti as easy and simple as possible. And here we go. And the back games. I am using coloring ball template. All links are down below. Open 3D World. I know you have questions. I don't have answers. Clearly no manners, baby. I, I... Open assets library and import sphere. This will be our confetti asset. Open sphere asset and enable physics. Type is dynamic. Add delay and remove node. I set delay value to 3. Back to 3D world and open characters asset. Here we can see that if character collides with finish ground, then level is completed. Now I add debris explosion node from action menu. Asset's name field value is sphere. And scale range should be smaller, like 0.1 to 0.15. Uncheck using original color box. Now, open script editor. We want to use random colors. For that, drag set random color node. From that node, copy color function. And paste it to debris explosion node, replacing current color function. Here we can set how far from character explosion happens. I set location more to right and up and Z axis to negative so it doesn't interact with character. Delete set random color node as we don't need it anymore. Now I duplicate debris explosion node three times. And slightly changing its spawn locations for each node. I connect first explosion node directly with it collide node. For others, I add delay node between them. It gives color effect. First delay node's value is 0.2. Connect if collide node with delay node. And delay node with debris explosion node. Same thing with others. Add delay node, this time, value is 0.4.
and last delay node's value is 0.6. Let's test it out. We can tonight, leave it all behind. Looks pretty cool. Thank you for watching and subscribe for more videos.